Jeff Clouser, General Manager of Epic Manufacturing, and today I'd like to talk to you about the Epic advantage of our pumps that we put on our machines and how they're going to increase productivity and performance for you on the job site. The first pump I'd like to talk to you about is the gear pump that we use on our 600, 750, 900, and 1200 gallon machines. This gear pump is designed to pump the thickest slurries in the industry. These pumps are have several advantages. One of the big ones is that it's not prone to cavitation like a centrifugal pump. Cavitation happens when you run the paddles too fast with a slurry that contains tackifier or uh, thick wood mulch. Air gets into that slurry when the paddles are run too fast. With a centrifugal pump, that can cause problems. It can cause cavitation, which basically means that the pump loses prime. The gear pumps that we use on our smaller machines don't cavitate because they can pump air. So not only can they pump a thicker slurry, they can pump air. In addition, everything that goes into those pumps gets pumped out the other side. They don't bypass internally and lose performance with thicker slurries. This gives you tremendous performance in hose applications and on smaller machines like our 600 to 1200 gallon size frame, a lot of the work is done with hose. So on a centrifugal pump, you might get 300 feet of hose on an average job and that's about all you'd ever want to spray with. I personally have sprayed through 750 feet of hose with our gear pump and I've heard customers talk about spraying through 1,000 and even 1,500 feet of hose with the gear pump and the capability that provides for hose applications. So that's the style pump we use on our smaller machines because of those advantages. No cavitation, can pump a thicker slurry, and can pump through tremendous lengths of hose. At the same time, we're able to get the same turret performance as our competitors that run centrifugal pumps. Generally, the industry thinks that a centrifugal pump has the advantage of greater turret distance. Well, we found on our smaller machines with that gear pump that we can get comparable turret performance to the other machines on the market, but vastly superior hose performance, thick slurry performance, and re reduction or elimination of cavitation issues while you're on the job. Generally, when a centrifugal pump cavitates, you have to go back to a water source, flush water into the pump to get it to start spraying again. This dramatically reduces your productivity on that job. So this is why we offer the gear pumps on our smaller machines. When you step up to our chassis mounted machines like the 1700 gallon machine behind me now, we switch to a Vortex centrifugal pump. When you get to this size machine, the turret performance is more important than the hose. And you cannot get much more than 170, 180 feet out of a gear pump, which is fine on a 1200 gallon machine. But on these larger machines, we're looking for greater distances to spray from the turret. So instead of going with a standard gear pump with tight tolerances and more potential to clogging, we've opted for a vortex centrifugal pump, which has a much more open impeller. It creates a vortex which sucks the material into the pump and pumps it out with minimal contact with the impeller during that process. This dramatically reduces the amount of clogs you can get inside the pump and improves performance with thicker slurries. So whether you're looking at a small machine or a larger chassis mounted machine, we have solutions that reduce your issues on the job site with clogging and cavitation and at the same time increase, increase productivity because you're able to pump through longer lengths of hose and you're able to pump thicker slurries and you're able to spray farther from the turret gun. Thank you very much.